it's our last sort of evening night here in France and then tomorrow morning catch a flight to London and then to Miami and then Raleigh Durham. Today's January 3rd. Today's my last day in France, visiting my family. My parents have already left to go back home and most of my extended family here have also left to go back to either Paris or wherever they're from. And so right now it's just me, my brother and his fiance with my grandparents. And tomorrow morning we leave early to the airport. So today we have one last day. We have to just do some things like get COVID test, make sure we're, we test negative and then do certain forms, pack, and just enjoy the last day. So right now I'm going up to this fireman watchtower. I think this is the seventh time on this trip that I've done it. I'd never done it before, but my grandfather told me about it and, and it's fun to do, but today, it's not the most cloudy it's been, but as you can see all of that fog down in the center of the sort of valley or below the mountains, but hopefully where I'm going today, by the time I get there, there will still not be any fog up top. Because I think two days ago when I went, it was completely foggy up there. I couldn't see anything, so let's go. registration for Duke and man was it was a big success. Um, I think we had like 160 plus groups to register and each group can be up to 12 at maximum so it's a lot of students who are hoping to go to Coach K's last game and in camera. Goodbye Watchtower. Goodbye Mountain View. Until next time. You're getting COVID tested. We all tested negative, so looks like we're all good to go back to the US. <laughs> which the recipe is actually patented. It's called the Tarte Tropezienne. It has basically just two brioche with just this really sweet cream in between. And, uh, I don't know if you can patent the recipes in the United States, but you can in France. This is from 2016, I'm collecting it on the beach. And my grandparents' apartment is right there. So this is the, the lighthouse of the town of Cassis. It's sort of the port. And that's the beach of Cassis. 
drive all the way up to the top of those cliffs and a lot of people will take really nice photos up there.